Listen up, it's the secret sauce. And secret sauce is this. Uh, what's something that you feel like is working well in your businesses right now that you could recommend to other owners to help, you know, take their business up a level? For me to give them the, I, we've already talked about it, but for me to give them the number one for me is, is the, the marketing segment that we talked about. I mean, um, I, I don't mean to be redundant with that, but mm. um, that, that's got to be done. I mean, that, that is the number one thing that's, that's probably one of the, the things that I'm most proud of. I mean, I have a very, very talented individual that, that is doing our marketing. And if it wasn't for that, we would not be where we are at. Um, whether it be one store, whether it be 11 stores, it doesn't matter. The marketing comes down to it. And then specifically, like I said, online. Okay. So just, we didn't talk about this in the marketing specifically. So, okay. Talk to the owner right now who maybe either isn't doing any marketing or, you know, maybe is throwing 50 or hundred bucks a month at Google ads or something like that. Where should they start? Like what's, what's a good first step if they say, okay, I want to up my marketing game. What's a good first step for them? So what I would say is, um, you know, once again, there's a, there's a little bit of variable and depending on size of the store budget, all that good stuff. I mean, there are certainly marketing firms and marketing companies. I mean, prior to me having a full-time marketing individual within, within house, um, I used a marketing firm, a local marketing firm that I could physically go sit down with them, look them face to face and work with it in person, what my goals are, what we're trying to do, and then follow up with them on a, you know, a monthly basis. Um, obviously that, that's, that's somewhat expensive, you know, and it got to a point to where it made more sense and better quality in house. But, um, prior to that is, you know, it, it, it's on you individually. So in the nights, in the evenings, um, you know, on the weekends, um, you know, I forget about sleep and, and, and focus on learning and, and getting better at the marketing and taking some of like the free online, like Google workshops and things like that to, uh, to be better at the, uh, the ad words and to be better at organic and then see what you can do. Um, you know, work on a website, you know, if, if, if you're, confident enough, build your own website to, to base it off of, you know, and, uh, buy your domain. Um, if, if you're not, or you have a, have a relationship or, you know, go to a company that's going to build, you know, a simple website. I mean, it doesn't have to be an elaborate website by any means. I mean, it needs to be, it, it's gotta be something and you'll find this like in the, the store and we'll find this when they do some of the research, like with the Google AdWords and, and the organic side of things, the keywords and, 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 um, the content that is on the website is more important than having some kind of flashy website. Um, but being very clear, concise to the point. Um, and, and, and that's on you. And then I also, you know, recommend, so working with other companies like uh, Vista print and things like this to do some mailers, but once again, make sure that it's targeted and then set a goal for yourself. And, and um, as you're trying to achieve more turns per day on a weekly and monthly basis, make a determination or, you know, continuing doing that. Are you going to keep the same percentage of your gross revenue in, uh, for advertising expense, or are you going to modify that and how are you going to modify that? Um, so yeah. And, and, and break your budget up that way, but yeah. starting off, it's on you. Awesome tips. Two things I'll say, I'll say about that is number one is, uh, I actually have a free course where I went through and I built a laundromat website, uh, and, uh, right, right in front of you. And I actually give you a template so that you can start right where I am and you can do that for free. And it's a good looking website. And that exact website ranks number one on Google for one of my laundromats. So uh, you you yeah. that modify it however you want to. I'll put a link to that in the show notes, or if you're on YouTube, it'll be down below in the description. 